We wanted to find and exemplify the most creatively and commercially compelling ideas that were able to respond to classical marketing challenges in ways that offer a refreshing break from conventional thinking, prove the impact they caused as a result, and place brands in a position of strength to be part of a more contemporary cultural discourse. The Grand Prix winners in creative effectiveness and creative strategy demonstrate how the work makes an impact that travels beyond the confines of the category or the geography it operates in, which gives it the propensity to inspire on a grand scale. The Creative Effectiveness Grand Prix winner stood out for many reasons. The objectives were undeniably audacious given the nature of the problem. The creative approach was bold and provocative in a way that further enforced the credibility of the brand. And the resulting impact was clearly caused by a creative idea that was current and enduring at once. The Creative Effectiveness Grand Prix winner for Eurobest 2020 is... Over-tourism is a global problem and the Faroe Islands has twice as many tourists as residents. To keep the islands unspoiled, we needed to turn tourism into voluntourism, so we closed the country. We asked the Prime Minister to help. On behalf of the Faroese government, I hereby declare the Faroe Islands closed for maintenance and open for voluntourism during the last weekend of April. During the weekend, all sites and attractions will be closed for regular tourists. However, we invite volunteers from abroad to lend us a helping hand by... But will people travel far to help a foreign country for free? Within just four days, 3,500 people from all over the world had signed up. On the last weekend of April, volunteers from 25 countries arrived to help maintain the islands. Together with locals, the volunteerists help maintain walking trails, viewpoints and fences to preserve the country's nature. And then the story went viral again. 500 articles, a massive online readership, 30 million social media actions, and a zero media budget. Fantastic for the pharaohs, fantastic for the environment, for nature. Doing a bit of hard work, I think, you know, it's worth it, definitely. Amazingly, when we closed, 10 times more volunteerists signed up to help the Faroe Islands.